Hi, it's a great day in Southern California. This is Interstate 8. Today we're going to visit the town of Ocotillo, or Ocotillo, either way is fine. Highway S2, and the first stop here is the Bike Stop Cafe. I don't see it, there it is. I think that's it here. And we're gonna take you uh, on a tour. I'll give you some facts and some fun little history about this little town of Ocotillo. Ocotillo, California, home of Stagecoach Century 25, 50, 100 miles. Ultimate 100 mile four person team time trial. Here are the record holders here. Woman's record, five hours, nine minutes. And the men's record, four hours, 15 minutes. So we'll take a slow drive through town. And first up is our little local post office of Ocotillo. So this town is named after the Ocotillo plant, Fuquieria splendens, and that means vine cactus in Spanish. Now it's not a town, but it's really a census designated place or CDP. It's in Imperial County, about 26 miles west of El Centro. 8.9 square miles, 380 feet above sea level. This place is all land and there's no water. This street's called Sagebrush. We got a big windmill farm out here too. So Ocotillo was originally founded as a retirement community. The post office opened in 1957. It's got a population of 215 people in 2020, down from 266 people in 2010, and 296 people in 2000. So people seem to be leaving this beautiful little place. T-Rex. Oh, we got a T-Rex over here. Wow, Tyrannosaurus Rex. There's some euphorbias. There's a blooming Ocotillo right here. All right, we've got some barrel cacti, feral cactus cylindricius. It's a creosote bush. This is a huge fire cactus. Wow, euphorbias right there. Look at that. This place is really nice though. So, right now, there's 42% males. 58% female, the median age is 59 years old, and the median household income is $36,000 per year, and 37% of the residents seem to be living below the poverty level. And a detached home here will cost you about $173,000. So in 1976, this place was devastated by floods from Hurricane Kathleen. And unfortunately, three people died too. So in town, we have a cafe, a church, a small park, a community center, a small market, two bars, OHV rentals, and a gas station, which is a Chevron station. There's the Lizard, or the Lazy Lizard Saloon, the Yokotillo Trailer Park, Jackson's Hideaway RV Park, the Great Escape, Food and Spirits. I'm gonna head down uh, another street here. It's all open. Wow. There's a desert museum with displays about the desert terrain, plants, Native American artifacts, and other cool desert stuff. Right here is the Lazy Lizard Bar. Wow. Okay, what else can I tell you about this place? Well, hundreds of millions of years ago, this was all under the ocean. And more recently, Akatillo sat at the edge of the ancient Lake Kahua which eventually uh, 
subdivided in today's Salton Sea in the dried up lake. Well, completely dried up in 1580. And this partially refilled after a uh, Colorado agricultural engineering disaster in the early 1900s. But now it's totally dry again. I think you see some bulker. And uh, like Salt Sea, there is a little bit of folk art around here. Like this guy right here. He's a, uh, looks like a marine or something. Maybe an aviator. <laughs> so anyway, if you get to the uh, Imperial Valley Desert Museum, it's a new facility. How do houses indigenous and historic artifacts, lots of archaeology. They got a little interactive tour. So we're gonna head uh, up this way still till we get to our destination, which is Dos Cabezas Primitive Campsite. And here we have some more homes. For our residents, we have smoke trees. Palo Verde's. There's a smoke tree right here. American smoke tree. This is 3rd Street. I love all this native California shrub. Absolutely beautiful. little place here. This little shop or homes. It's a vacant lot or it's like a former park. All these are creosote bushes. This guy right here. Look at that. There we tried in Tata. Wow. With the cacti. Up here is the dump. Up here, the county refuse disposal area. Take your trash. Oh, these are California fan palms. Washingtonia filifera. He's the only palm tree that's native to California. Little abandoned house here. to these really ugly wind farm windmills. They just wreak havoc on the desert tortoises we have out here. That's a shame. But we're saving the planet, so I guess that's good. Blooming Texas. I can teal here. Check out that guy. Look at those beautiful blooms. Nice car. Little abandoned home over here. It's a beautiful house. Lots more windmills. Holy smokes. Here's the Acatillo Community Park coming up. I'll show you this and then get on our way out to Dos Cabezas Campground. Get out of the car, we'll take a quick look. And beware of snakes. And, uh, Make sure you beware of snakes. So, uh, let's take a look here. Our beautiful community park. 
There's palm trees up here. Fan palms. Looks like an oleander. Got our smoke trees. A little baseball field here. For the kids. Lots of pretty little yellow flowers growing in the ground. Some more palms. And a little playground. Wow. Look at this guy here. Look at these little beautiful purple flowers here. This little guy. Super. Anyway, that's our wonderful town of uh, Ocotillo, Southern California, Imperial County. Hope you like that video. Please share, like, subscribe, all the rest, and have a great day. Thanks for watching.